Hey, what's up guys? This is Justin at wingsound.com. In this video, you'll learn how to do multiple loops on one sample in Battery 3. And don't forget, you could always get in contact with me with any questions, comments, or ideas, justin at wingsound.com. All you gotta do is click on one, two, three, or four, depending on how many you wanna add, and just click this little button here to enable. Click two, enable, three, enable, four, enable. So as you can see, I have all four loops. They're all on top of each other, all with the same loop mode and the same count. Loop mode is release key, loop until key released, and the count is infinite. So when you hit it, you know, it doesn't really do much. So the way these loops, you know, when you set up multiple loops, how they work is you gotta set different lengths and starting points for them. And then you also have to adjust the count on how many times they're played. Because if you leave them all in infinite, then it's just going to play, you know, all them together, which is not really going to do much. So let's say loop two. Oh, actually, start with loop one. I want the length just to be this little beginning part here. Loop two, a little bit after loop one. And then loop three. A little bit after loop two and then loop four after three just the end tail part so you know i hit the key again just to show you that nothing really happens you know kind of sounds like if you just looped uh just this first part that's what that would sound like so like i said you gotta take the count into consideration so let's say loop one i want to loop eight times loop two five i'm you know just making some random selections here usually that's kind of for me at least you get some really cool stuff that you would you know you wouldn't really think about because you're doing it randomly so all right, so now what you want to do to get some really cool thing going is on the loop mode, change the loop mode of, of some of those loops. So loop three, I'm going to change the loop mode to loop until end of envelope. So it'll loop three times and then go to loop four. So for two, I'm going to do the same, change the loop mode to loop until end of envelope. So loop two will loop five times. Then go to loop three, loop three, three times, and then it'll loop loop four 20 times. And loop one is gonna be eight. But to do this, you have to choose the loop mode to loop until end of envelope. Make sure it's on all of them. So let's check this out now. Get some cool stuff going you know you could take a hi-hat hit and make different loop points and have them loop different amounts of time and get like some cool hi-hat variations going on by changing the tune so let's say you know loop two i'm gonna bring it down and then loop three i'll bring it up You can always get in touch with Justin at WinkSound.com and check out more of Justin's videos including these titles featuring the new Pro Tools 8 now available on demand at WinkSound.com.